Hello everyone, Grandma here for April Fools and because Grandpa hates peas, today I am making chocolate pea cookies. These healthy chocolate pea cookies are packed full of a green vegetable and you'll never know it. Here's the ingredients. One cup of steamed green peas cooled. Two eggs. Three-fourths of a cup of peanut butter. One-fourth cup of cocoa powder. One-third cup of sugar. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. One teaspoon of baking soda. A half a cup of chocolate chips. This is a very easy recipe. All you have to do is add all the ingredients in a food processor except the chocolate chips. So I'm not going to talk because when I put my food processor in, it's very, very loud. So I'm adding in my peas. The peanut butter. The two eggs. Cocoa powder, the sugar, the baking soda, and the vanilla. And now we'll just begin to mix this all up. We have to keep mixing this till it's smooth and well blended. Okay, we check this now. Scrape the sides and then I'll just put it on for a little while longer, a few minutes and then it all should be done. Check it again. Seems pretty smooth to me now. So, I think it's all done. Now I'm going to add this. I'm going to put it in my uh, mixing bowl. Because now we have to, the last thing we have to do is add the chocolate chips. I scooped all the chocolate I could get out of the food processor all the mixture. So now all I have to do is add the chocolate chips. These are semi-sweet chocolate chips. And you mix this by hand in there and that's it. And now I have to preheat my oven to 350 degrees. I'm going to try to mix this in well, mix the chips in well, and that's it. And this is how easy it is to make this cookie. I lined my cookie sheet with parchment paper. You have to preheat your oven to 375 degrees. And now I'm going to scoop with my cookie scoop. I'm going to scoop out the batter. I don't know how big these are going to spread out. So I'm not going to put too many on the sheet. Till I find out how the first batch will come out after I cook it. I have my 12 and I'm not going to put more on because I want to see how these spread out. They just came out of the oven 
and this is what they look like. The second batch is going to go into the oven, so we'll end up with 24 cookies. The second batch is out of the oven. I had them baking for 14 minutes because these are insulated pans and you have to cook them a few minutes extra. But if you have normal baking sheets, pans, you would only have to cook them maybe anywhere from 10 to 12 minutes. Let's see what they taste like. Grandpa's never going to guess what they're made out of because they taste like chocolate and peanut butter. How's it taste, Grandpa? I'll let you know in a minute, Ma. What do I got here? Cookies? Yep. Chocolate. Very rich chocolate. It's got a chocolatey flavor. It's got a peanut flavor. Very, very good. What other ingredients do you taste? Trying to pick it off, but I can't. Because I got the peanut butter and the rich chocolate flavor. Nice chocolate. Whatever's in there, else is in there, I don't know. But it reminds me of those Hostess cupcakes that I used to eat years ago. But it's got the peanut butter flavor in it. And there's no little icing on top. No icing, but it's got like a little crunch to it because of the, the hardness of the chocolate. I don't know what else is in here. All I know is cho nice chocolate, peanut butter. If there's something else in there, oh, what do we got here? A, a chocolate chip, I see. Yep, you're right. There's some chocolate chips in there also. Delicious. I'm glad you liked them, Pa. But I really fooled you making these cookies. Yeah? Guess why? Why? Because they're made with your very, very favorite ingredient. A very favorite ingredient. Mounds? No. Not coconut. No. Vanilla. Not vanilla. I give up. Well, there's vanilla in there, but... April Fool Peas! Oh! Oh! oh. I hope it don't react on me. Well, you said you could eat the, all of them now. Oh, you said April Fool's, so you don't have them in there. That's right. Just trying to pull an April Fool's joke now on me. They're in there. Oh. I'm glad the peanut butter overrode it. Well, I'm glad you like it. So now you should say you like peas. I don't like peas. I see green peas I don't eat. Well, you like these cookies. That's for sure. Happy April Fool's Day, everybody. I'm glad I fooled Grandpa. Oh.